Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. And it's time to start another Yurtle unboxing. Yay! Um, for those of you who don't know or are just joining us, um, Yurtle is like an online garage sale where you can list your things and purchase other people's things. Um, the only catch, I suppose, is that instead of buying and selling with like cash, you're buying and selling with Yurtle dollars. So, Technically everything's free because it's Yurtle money and Yurtle money isn't real money. The only real money you do have to spend though is on shipping and handling. So you will have to pay for that. But otherwise, everything else is pretty much free. And I like to do the unboxings of everything I get off of Yurtle because y'all know I like to Yurtle. So I got a box in here today and I've got several more coming. Um, and we'll go ahead and get on into this one and see because this one's quite a large box. It's definitely bigger than I was expecting to get and I'm not entirely sure what's in here because I don't remember what I've ordered that would have come in so soon. So, oh, I did not expect this to get here. I figured this would be a while and I figured it'd be in a much smaller box. Um, I got a bra. <laughs> uh, bras are quite expensive in real life, you all know that. So, and I'm not against wearing other people's bras. Um, it's just a really pretty blue one. And uh, something nice about this, and I've had a bra like this before, is that it has these little inserts here. Um, which I'm not sure if this one has the inserts or not. It does. So if you don't want to have like a super push-up day, you can take the insert out from right here. Here's the insert. You can take it out. Or if you do want to have the uh, super push-up day, you can have the insert in. And it just gives you gives your boobs a little extra lift. So that's always a nice option. Um, and this is just... An absolutely gorgeous colored bra. So pretty. Um, and there's like the wires not poking out or anything. So that's good. And it looks like... No, it's not convertible as if you could take off all the straps. But you could take off the straps here in the back. So like if you need to do a razor back or something. That's always a nice option. Um, and what is the brand here? Uh, Airy. I've never heard of it. A-E-R-I-E. -E. Never heard of it. But... That's a really pretty bra, so I'm definitely excited to be getting to use that. The next one in here should be, let's see if I can find it, there's so much padding in here. I was pretty sure I ordered this off of the same person, but so far I'm not in here. And I'm going to be pretty upset if they didn't get shipped out. So, this would be the first time something didn't ship in one of my urinal hauls, because this was supposed to be a bundle. Yeah, they're not in... Oh, no, here they are. I was about to get pissed. <laughs> um, she had listed some Victoria's Secret panties that she never wore. I'm guessing that she got these as freebies. Um, if You may or may not know, but if you have a Victoria's Secret credit card, like monthly, they will send you the option to go in and get a free panty. She said she's never used these. They weren't something that she liked. She just got them because they were free, which I've been there. I've totally done that. Um, and they're just little lacy thongs, which... Thongs are my panties of choice, if you care to know. I hate having panty lines, and thongs just eliminate that. So, these are, like, the one-size-fits-all, I think is what she said. Or a large, or, no, they're, like, the one-size-fits-all, I think. Um, which is fine. They'll, they'll fit me. But, we got a lacy black one. A pretty little lacy peach one. And a lacy yellow one. So, that's always great. And again, like, y'all know how expensive Victoria's Secret is and how expensive their undies are. I think these are like $10 a piece. So, I just got three of these plus a bra for $5 of shipping. Not a bad deal, if I say so myself. So, that wraps up my Yurtle haul for today. Y'all know that I don't like to uh, hoard my shipments as they come in. I like to share them with you as I get them so that I can start using them. So, I do have a few more things that will be coming in, so I'll be filming them as we go. Y'all know how I work with that. And I feel like I have something else to say. Yes, I also have a link to Yurtle, so if you guys are interested in checking out Yurtle at all, um, it's definitely free to shine up. Definitely free to sign up. doesn't cost you anything. I'll leave my link to Yurtle down below. If you use my link when you sign up for Yurtle, you'll get some extra Yurtle dollars to spend, and so will I. Um, again, no pressure. You don't have to use my link if you don't want to. Um, but if you do use my link, you'll get some extra Yurtle monies. So I'll see you guys in a few days when I get some more shipments. Hey guys, <laughs> kind of changing up the, uh, the background scenery on you. Um, new filming space. I hope you guys enjoy it. So, got another box in today. 
I'm pretty sure these are the boots I ordered. So, as y'all know, shoes are expensive. Like, seriously. And uh, unlike most girls, I don't really like shoe shopping. Like, I pretty much just live in black old navy flip-flops and tell those to know on the ground. And then I go for boots. Then I've got a pair of sneakers I use when I need sneakers. And then I've got a pair of black flats that I like, which I wear for work now. Um, otherwise, I don't really buy a lot of shoes. Um, and I don't really change my shoes up that often. Personally, I like to be barefoot. I don't really like, I don't know. If I could, I'd probably just go barefoot all the time. Um, but that's not how the world works, and you can't do that. And I'm, like, struggling with this box. So, I ordered a pair of boots off of Yertle. And I'm hoping they fit. Ooh, these are cute. They're much shorter than I thought they'd be. I thought they would be, like, the uh, mid-calf style boots. But these are still really very cute. And they're very thick. But, ooh, there's a lot of These need to be washed. There's, like, dust on them. Should I see that, like, poof off of there? Okay, so... This is what they look like. Really cute. Um, I think I paid like five bucks in shipping for them. I'm not sure what the brand is. But I know I would be spending a pretty penny on them in stores. Let me see. This doesn't seem to say anything about a brand. But, oh, they're down here. They are Easy Spirit. So, I'm not really familiar with that brand. Not really sure how much this brand costs normally. Or how much they are normally. But they're in really good condition. They're very cute. They'll be great this winter for snow and such. Uh, these are like the kind of boots I live in in the winter. Basic white girl. But these are basically amazing when it comes to snow. And they hold up really well. And of course you can always just throw them in the washing machine if you need to wash them. Which is going to happen with these since there's like a powder all over them. Um, but that's just what they look like. Nothing too exciting. But I was pretty excited to find these on Yertle. And again I only paid like 5 bucks in shipping for them. So I feel like Yertle is a great place you feel better? Okay. I just feel like Yertle is a great place to be able to get all those like little life necessities that you need but you don't necessarily want to spend like regular monies on. So that's uh that's that for today. I've got a couple more things coming in the mail so I'll see you guys in a couple more days. Got another Yertle today. <laughs> so I'm pretty excited about this one. This one is a Victoria's Secret sports bra. I'm hoping it fits. I got it in a 32 double D I think which let's be honest my titties are not a double D but yeah 32 double D um that being said I've noticed their bras for Victoria's Secret kind of seem to run small because I have another Victoria's Secret bra that I believe is a double D and it fits me really well, whereas like if I got a double D someplace else, like it's going to be massive. So, And this one looks like it'll fit fairly well too. And isn't that just so cute? I've never actually had Victoria's Secret sports bras before. So that one is so cute. And see what I mean? Like it just kind of looks small. Like it doesn't look that big. Um, and here's the back. So, And it's going to get used today because Mike and I are going to start hitting the gym. Um, you all know Mike changed jobs and at this a new job, like, for one, the insurance is insane for paying for it, um, but for number two, they have, like, this whole, like, point system or something where you get money off for each point that you get, and I think for having a healthy BMI, you get, like, um, two points towards having money taken off or something, so, and the next health and fitness thing or whatever at his job evaluation, um, is a few months from now, so... We're hoping to be able to lose enough weight to get down to the healthy BMI. I mean, it's going to go on him, not on me. But I want to continue losing weight, too. I've lost about 15 pounds since probably on January-ish time frame, give or take. Possibly a little bit more. Um, well, I'd be closer to 20 pounds, depending. But I'd love to lose more weight. I mean, I'm... We don't need to get all into this for a year to haul, but I would definitely like to lose some more weight. So this is coming just in time because I could totally use a sports bra. I don't own one. Um, so this is going to get lots and lots of use. So. so I got a whole bunch of yurtles in today. Look at this. Look at this. Giant stack of yurtles. 
we got four packages here and there's more on the way so this video is already getting long, getting long enough as it is getting tongue-tied and we're just getting started um <clears throat> This video is getting long enough as it is. I think we're at like 21 minutes already or something like that. So I'm going to have to do some serious editing to kind of bring it back a notch. Because I'm going to open one of these packages for you guys today. Show you what it is. And then we'll get into the rest of these yodel packages in my next yodeling video. Um, but I don't want to get it too long. Even though I know Jay... Is it Saraz? I'm horrible with names. I don't want to try anymore. I'll probably butcher it. But I know you commented and said that you like my long yurtling video. So this one's for you, um, Jay. <laughs> I was going to say baby, but that's weird. Uh, I don't know you like that. Sorry. I work with kids all day long. So please don't take any offense. I'm nuts. Um, it's weird because I groom dogs and I work at a daycare center. So <laughs> I'll go to put a kid in like their playpen and I'll be like, it's time to put you in your crate. And it's like, you're not a puppy. You're not going in a crate. <laughs> or I'll go to like, <laughs> there's been several times I've had to go get something out of a kid's hair and I'll be like, you got something in your fur, but it's, you know, it's not fur, it's hair. And same way with like dogs and stuff, I'll talk to them like they're kids and funny story. I try, I tie people's shoes like all day long. I mean, they're little toddlers, they can't do it themselves. And uh, anyways, my husband and I went out to a restaurant to get some food. It's like a fast food. <laughs> It's a fast food joint down the road, and we were, we were waiting on our food to get ready because we always take it and go home with it, and I noticed his shoes were untied, and I just bent down and tied them, and he just kind of looked at me like, what the fuck? <laughs> so anyways, we'll get on into this. Uh, I think we'll go ahead and go with this pretty red packaging because it's red, and I like the color red, and I have no other, I don't know, that's just, that's how that went, so we'll go ahead and open this up here <clears throat> and I've got so much stuff coming like I couldn't even begin to tell you what is where or what is what so this is Molly's doggy costume I wasn't sure what it was at first but then I remembered the lady messaged me and was like hey uh, I added something extra so this says the little little info sheet it says thank you I included an additional costume for you sorry again for overloading it was the overloading it the first time or overlooking it the first time that's right I ordered this item and you have like six or seven days to ship something out to your buyer and she never shipped it so she relisted it for me and I rebought it and all that stuff and of course if somebody doesn't ship your stuff to you on Yurtle you get refunded all of your money back so yeah that's all it says <laughs> and then here we go this is the, uh, this is cute. This is the additional item she added. It's just a little hoodie and it's a little devil. It's got little devil horns. So stinking cute. And then this next one, I'm so excited. I can't wait for Mike to come home and see her in this. It is Superman, yes. Um, it would be nice if this had had like a cape on the back of it because it doesn't, but I can't wait to stick her in this. So I will definitely film her in both of these costumes. I'll add that at the end of this video, like I do a lot of my videos where I just add a little bit, a uh, little clip or something of my critters doing something adorable. So we'll go ahead and wrap up this video here. I just want to say thank you for watching. Um, please give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you have not already. If you are interested in joining Yurtle, checking Yurtle out, again, it is totally free to sign up. Um, Buying and selling on Yurtle is essentially free. You're only using Yurtle money, but you do have to pay cash for shipping. So just be aware of that. But again, my link for Yurtle will be down below if you want to go check out Yurtle. Totally free. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please subscribe if you have not already. Give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments down below. Hope you're enjoying all of my hand gestures. I'll see you guys in my next video. So here's Molly in her devil horn costume as you can see she loves it not really she hates anything with hats uh, kind of funny how like the tail hangs off to the side there we'll pull that up I need to go through all of her shirts with hoodies and like put like a snap or something or a little stitch to put them back here because she hates them when they're on her head I don't know how well she likes this it's kind of thick you look cute why don't you go walk around You look miserable. That big fluffy tail. The big fluffy tail. Come on.
Move. Do something. Oh, I like how like the devil horns still stick up in the back, even though I have the hood off of her. <laughs> yeah, not a fan of this one. And she's down. And here she is in her Superman one. Banjo. Maybe we should put banjo on that. Aww. That doesn't look as exciting as I thought it would be. <coughs> I see videos of doggies and stuff like this. And like, it looks hilarious. Because like the arms flap around. But this one doesn't seem to really be doing that too much. Maybe we should put it on banjo. Come here. Yeah, I think it's a little too big for her. Look at that. It's like hanging off her feet down here. We'll put it on banjo. Oh, 